Hey, Electric Ed here, Matter Guitar Products. Hey, we are excited to demonstrate our new Terminator 4.3 system, which is for humbucker, single, single. And it has a five-way slugger switch, volume, and tone. It's also available on a dual tone um, system. It incorporates a push-pull pot. Uh, when the push-pull pot is down, you have the, the same five settings that you normally would rec know with the humbucker single, single. You pull up it on it, you get a new set of tones. So let's go over that. First of all, let's start with this guitar. I want to go in a little bit of detail about what this guitar is that we're using to demo this. This is a Fender Squire Strat. The main reason why we like it is we like the uh, Floyd Rose because it makes it easy to swap out pick cards by just pulling out the back springs and then uh, we don't have to change strings every time we, we want to swap stuff out. So, but this guitar is a popular body, it sounds very much similar to Alder. Maple neck, rosewood fretboard, a uh, couple modifications we did to it. For the pickguard to fit, we do have to uh, notch it out for the Floyd Rose, make it a little bit bigger and drill another hole here, money hole. Also, the pickguards on a standard fender, the uh, pickup sits further back than what was originally in here, so we did have to carve out a little bit of wood, not much. And uh, one of the modifications we also did was the springs. Uh, these are DiMarzio springs we found a liner fender, probably be good. The ones that came stock with it were not consistent. Every time we took them out, put them in, we found that the tuning always changed. So, or if we hit the, the, the Floyd Rose a little bit too hard, you know, things would change, the tuning would also change. So we found uh, these springs to be more consistent and better quality. So that was like a $12 upgrade. Um, one of the other things we had to do was uh, fretboard front ends were a little rough. Uh, especially this one on the end was hanging over, so I had to file it back. Uh, on the edges, I just basically took some uh, 220 sandpaper, just went across the edges of the frets, uh, just to kind of pull them back a little bit. It's nice with rosewood, you, you know, you're not going to hurt it uh, just by lightly, go, lightly going up and down with sandpaper. And then I took some steel wall over it and tell you what, this guitar sounds and plays great. Obviously, it sounds great because it has a Terminator system in it and has some upgraded pickups. Pick card on here with the red trim kind of sets it up. We got the, our Rapid fire kill switch on here, which is kind of cool. Uh, anyways, enough about the guitar. Let's talk about the Terminator 4.3 system. Now, what we love about this system is uh, when you, like all other Terminator, like the 5.3 and the 3.3, when you pull up on a push pull pot, basically gives you a new set of tones and pickup combinations that we think are very useful. When it's down, it's the same five combinations you know and love. So, in this one, when it's down, we're going to have position one's going to be the humbucker. The humbucker we have in here is the Mad Hatter Super Shredder humbucker, manufactured us by Lenny Freeland. In my opinion, best humbucker pickup out there. I just, I mean, I just love it. No clarity is great. The tone is great. It cuts through the mix. It just, everything about it is just, it's just a wonderful pickup. And it splits really nice too. Um, position two is going to split the humbucker and, you, with, and it's going to have it with the middle. Position three is going to be the middle only. Position four, middle and neck. And position five, neck as you expect. So, about the only difference that you may have here that you may not have with your regular guitar is position two, you're going to split the humbucker with the, when it's uh, in parallel with the neck. So, let's go to the, modif the modified uh, uh, mode by pulling push, push, pull, pot. Now what we're going to have, we're still going to have the humbucker there. So basically on this system, position one is not going to change. It's going to be your anchor. It's that, that humbucker pickup you can always go hit back to regardless of whether your push-pull pot is in or out. You're always going to have position one is going to be the same regardless. Position two now, what you're going to have is just the humbucker split. That's it. So basically the next four settings are going to be totally all new different tones. So now position two, you're just going to have the humbucker split. It's going to be that thinner, you know, that kind of uh, tone that's uh, by, you know, it's like a single coil pickup, bridge pickup. So you're going to have the humbucker with the middle and the neck in series. So it's going to be like two humbuckers put together. It's going to be very similar to if you're uh, with the Les Paul in that middle position where you have both humbuckers on the same time. It's very similar to that. You're going to have the humbucker and the neck pick up together. It's a sound we're familiar with. And that's going to be position four. But position five is now 
and it'll be the middle in the neck in series. So it kind of gives you, once again, that humbucker sound uh, with those two. So uh, these single coil pickups are DiMarzio Area 67s. They sound great. I, you know, they, I just love these pickups. These are good. I love a lot of pickups, as you might know if you watch my demo videos, but these sound really, really good. So let's just go through positions one through five in standard mode, just so you can hear them. And then we'll pull, engage the uh, push pull pot, and we'll go through the, these, the new settings. Uh, first of all, I might mention uh, the 4.3 system comes with a 250K push pull pot with a 47 microfarad cap. We will have an option optional 22 megapair cap and we always wear the we recommend wiring the volume pot for 250k so you're going to notice that the bridge pickup will be a little bit warmer with a 250k so anyways uh, and then personally a lot of my guitars i wire the bridge pickup at 250k so just especially on les pauls like i have back here because the, the bridge pickup is so close to the bridge um, it tends some pickups tend to get real bright and kind of I don't know, just kind of a, uh, a little bit harsh. When you, but when you put it on a 250K setting, it's, it just warms it right up a little bit, takes that harshness edge off of it. And like uh, my last Paul's back here, I have him wired to 250K on a bridge, and then I have him wired to 500K on a neck. So anyways, uh, let's go through these uh, uh, settings. So we'll start first with the bridge. Position two, now the bridge is going to split, with, it's going to be in parallel with the uh, middle. Now just the middle. Position four. Position five which should be the neck. So there you have it, positions one through five in standard mode. Now let's go and pull up on push pull pot. Once again, we're going to have the bridge. So it's a little bit warmer than this pickup usually sounds at 500k, you know. Now position two is going to be the humbucker split. So there you have it, so thin, just a single coil, it's like uh, that bridge pickup on a uh, single coil strap. So our super shredder pickups, actually, when they're split, they they really sound more like a true single coil than most traditional humbuckers. Well, let's go to position three, which is going to be, if you remember, it's going to be the humbucker with the middle and the neck in series. gives you a nice new combination of tones that you normally wouldn't have with this combination. So we're going to go position four, which is going to be humbucker and full humbucker with the neck position. And then position five is now going to be the middle and the neck in series. So here it sounds more like a humbucker. 
darker, especially these Area 67s, because they're a little bit warmer than, uh, like, uh, on a 3.3 demo we did, we had Texas Specials on there, which are real kind of brighter type single coil. These are a little bit warmer. Actually, I like these better. And actually, for this mod, they, they work great. They're perfect. Now let's uh, do position one, three, and five. So you can get a combination of all three humbucker modes, or what would be traditionally like a humbucker type setting. Uh, first, with the bridge. Position three, which would be bridge humbucker, middle and neck in series. Then position five, which is the middle and neck in series. play some signal notes going backwards you can really hear the difference how it went from darker to warmer and it's kind of with this system what I really like about it you can hear it uh, gradually get brighter on the fifth and the, I mean on the first position and the fifth position it gets darker on each three positions so anyways uh, let's throw some dirt on here so we'll start with the bridge pickup <laughs> skip position one or position two rather I'm gonna go right straight to position three now we're gonna skip position four and we're gonna go right straight to position five which is gonna be the middle in the neck in series. You still kind of hear a little bit of the single coil. And that's because they're kind of they're separated out, so you're not going to have that truce humbucker sound that you would have with a typical humbucker. But it does definitely warm it up. So you know, I'm going to give you an idea of what it sounds like. Let's do uh, um, right now. I got position five, so you have the middle and the neck together in series. push this down into position four so we have the middle and the neck in parallel so you can kind of hear the difference. Once again in series. So, so you get warmer. That's a very useful tone, especially for like rhythm or like um, demonstrating with like a lead type tone. Let's put a little uh, dirt on here, a little lead tone type stuff. So I just turn on my lead uh, patch. So basically, uh, let's start with the super shredder, and then we'll go to position one, three, and then five. Position one, three, and five with the lead tone on, kind of give you an idea what those sounds like. And there you have the Terminator 4 3 system available now at madhatterguitarproducts.com. We hope you enjoyed this demo. And uh, if you have any questions, hit us up at info at madhatterguitarproducts.com. Visit madhatterguitarproducts.com today and purchase your Terminator 4 3 system and hear what your guitar is missing. Thank you.